Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So I actually have a box to unbox today and this one has come actually from Create and Craft TV or I'm not quite sure what they're calling themselves now. They have been taken over by the Craft Channel which used to be her chander and they've One's bought the other and they've merged together. But anyway, um, this is a craft buddy item, but I got it from Create and Craft. Um, I'll put the links down below. And it's their new range of licensed artwork that they have brought out. So let me just grab a pair of scissors and just get this little box open. And I will show you what I've got. Okay, that's interesting. Um... I am a Lifetime Create and Craft Club member, which means I get 10% discount on all my purchases. And when I went through the checkout on the website, um, it did give me my 10% discount. But I've just received, I've just looked on the packing note, the invoice that they've put inside this package. Um, and I'm not sure that I have got my discount, so I'll have to check that. So, okay, never mind. I probably would have bought them anyway. Um, you can get them direct from Craft Buddy Crystal Art, but uh, they were cheaper to buy them as a bundle. This is the new set of Crystal Art Craft Buddy cards, and it's licensed artwork from Beatrix Potter, and it's all Peter Rabbit and friends. So I just couldn't resist these. Um, I don't know if anybody had the little white books when they were younger of all the different characters. I think they are going to bring out some of the characters as well. Um, and there are all different uh, canvases and uh, there's a smaller picture and there's a notebook. They are bringing out a scene as well with Peter Rabbit and a wreath as well, which <gasps> I just must, well, try not to get, but I'm sure I will. <laughs> so we have uh, Peter Rabbit coming under the gate. We have, uh, that's Peter and Mrs. Josephine Rabbit. Oh, they've all got little Peter Rabbit on the corner, look. We've got Peter Rabbit and Chicks, and we've got some Easter eggs there, so that would make a lovely Easter card. That's really pretty. We'll have a closer look at these in a minute. We have the Flopsy Bunnies. Oh, I liked that story. I did like my Beatrix Potter. And we have, oh, Benjamin Bunny. So we're definitely on a rabbit theme here. And there's Benjamin in the corner, look, in the uh, cabbage patch. Or is it the lettuce patch? I can't remember. Probably lettuce. And then, oh, Jemima Puddle Duck. Oh, I like Jemima. Oh, that's really pretty. So with each of these cards, as I say, you can buy them separately and this set has come, we've got six different ones, um, this set has come all packaged separately so you could give one to each friend. Uh, so here, uh, rather than, ma than uh, making you a birthday card this year, I've brought you a DIY kit. <laughs> okay, let's have a look at Jemima then. So yeah, each one, I mean, I, I love craft buddy do the packaging superbly you've got your little embossed emblem here that's um, silver and pink hot pink down there and it tells you here it makes one beautiful card on the back we do have the dmc numbers and then we also any gems we've got reference numbers on gems so if you've seen my previous video on how i store all my specials and my crystals these are the numbers that i'm using um, and matching things up so that's really good uh, hopefully i've got some different ones again so i can match some more up we get one card one envelope bags of crystals your pickup pen your wax and your tray so everything that you need um, other than a pair of scissors and if you can rip the bags open i never can but if you can rip your bags open um oh gosh my daughter uses her teeth oh great zombie <laughs> teeth grating together uh, then uh, yeah you don't need anything else so let's have a look at this one just pop this open i do it from the back and then it doesn't tear the card so i like to keep the cards okay so each little packet comes in its own separate little wallet what have we got there on the inside oh this is showing us some of the newer products that they've brought out recently albeit that's an Anne Stokes licensed artwork there. 
we've got Disney Lion King licensed artwork here um, notebooks, wreaths, so it's just showing us key rings, different little bits and pieces that they do. Uh, if you do place an order on the Craft Buddy website, then you can tick and get the full catalogue, which is wonderful. And you can just sit and browse through it and think, that's on my wish list, that's on my wish list, that's on my wish list. <laughs> you get a separate little packet of drills. Now, each one although it has uh, DMC codes on, is unique to this card. So you wouldn't be able to then use the numbers or the letters on this card to make the next one. These um, numbers, the A's, B's, C's, whatever, only relate to this card, albeit when you're then kitting down, they have DMC codes on them. So we have a nice little tool kit, which is branded. Very, very good. Let me just get this out. And it is your pen with your crystal art on. Nice set of gold foil in there. We've got a three placer and a single placer. We've got this usually round about 20 little grip seal bags. Um, they are quite thinnish. But uh, yeah, I mean, you can put your leftover drills in them if that's how you want to store them. So they're always a good quantity. So I'm not going to count them, but there usually is about 20 because I have counted them in the past. I've got a nice little square of red wax and a little white book with a spout. So rather than a green book, we've got a white book. So, you know, plenty to do your little card. And then the cards are all like a partial drill canvas. Now, they're... 18 centimetres by 18 centimetres which is about seven inches so they're quite a nice little picture you don't have to uh, use this as a greetings card you can actually frame these and craft buddy do sell um sets of three frames so you know you, you could actually uh, frame it and send it to somebody as a gift um and if you don't put sort of happy birthday or whatever on these um, or any greeting on them then whoever receives it can then just uh, frame it themselves and keep it as a picture so as i say the partials which means that the background isn't diamond painted um anywhere where there's the little rounds with uh, the numbers or letters on that is where your drills will go so this plant in the background here has got them these little flowers haven't uh, the ladybird has all of Jemima has and then all of this greenery on this plant has and they're blank inside so you can add your own greeting and um, you can put an insert in you can write a letter you know there's quite a, a big surface there that you can write on um, or you can just put hello <laughs> or just sign it you know if you're famous you can just put a signature in it <laughs> And then on the back, um, oh, that's good. We've got the licensed artwork for Peter Rabbit. And it, then it does have a code number on the back here. And as I say, that is unique to every canvas or every card or every project that you buy. And that will be on the bag with the drills. So if you ever lose your drills from your card you can, or your canvas, you can always just check the number to see which one matches up. So, you know, it's all quite nicely thought through. I do uh, like Craft Buddy. Um, it is how I got into diamond painting. Um, many moons ago, I did start buying their crystal art cards. Um, they were very different in those days. Um, they just used to come with like a little um, oh, a round tray. Didn't have any grooves in it. And they used to come up with one of those pick-up pencils. Uh, let me see if I've got one. Yeah, you used to. This is a Styx 2 one. But these are actually like a pick-up pencil. It's like a similar to a wax sort of um, effect in there. And when you sharpen it and it goes to a point. Um, all I can liken it to is like a pencil but like a pretty placer. So it's like it's tacky. So you can pick things up. And that's how I first did um, my first ones using one of these pencils that uh, used to come in the kits. Obviously now we've moved on to waxes and pens and people use all sorts of different things but that's what I started with and then I moved on to canvases. So let me just measure and double check the size for you so you can see what they are. Yeah. So yep, yeah, they're 18 centimetres square 
which yeah, is seven inch square. So you can use the card as is, or quite often I will um, just cut the front off and put this onto an eight inch by eight inch card um, so that I can put a border around. And that means then I can put names or whatever or greetings on the border of the card. So if the person then does want to take this off and frame it, then there's no writing or anything on it. It's still just the picture. A quick look at the drills. So I do like the card making still. Get these out. So what did we say on the back there? Looks like we've got 13 different gems and colours. Uh, Craft Buddy Arrow resin drills as well. They're not the acrylic ones, so they are the slightly better quality ones. And oh, these colours are lovely. We've got your standard, that's a 310 black. And then we've got all your corally, peachy, pinky colours. And then that one's like an orange colour. And a couple of blues and a bluey green. And then we've got like your, I reckon that's 3865, is it? Let me have a look. Yep, 3865, your creamy colour. And then we've got your red gems there, your pink and two different greens what i do find as well with craft buddy is that you get your different colors so you always get that depth in a picture you know we don't just go with one color or two colors they'll put three together so you get you know a contrast that goes through it that runs through something and you get your shadow and your depth there so let's pop these back in here i'm not going to go through the drills on every single one because uh, i think you'd probably fall asleep <laughs> So that's Jemima Puddle Book, which is your favourite Beatrix Potter character. I know I like, um, oh gosh, I do like Peter Rabbit. I like Mrs Tiggy Winkle as well, Willy Bill Hedgehog. I think she's really cute. I'm hoping they'll bring um, one of her out. So this is Benjamin Bunny. Again, we've got ooh, 17 colours in Benjamin. Uh, lots of greens there. So let's have a look at his card. And he's quite nice because he's like in a circle um, with a plain background. So that'll look really good if you wanted to frame that. That would really stand out. Possibly put it in a frame this colour or the green or even a black frame might just make it pop that little bit. We've got a little B on the edge there as well. Um, but yeah, he stood there with, I think, I'm sure Benjamin Bunny was in a cabbage patch. I'm sure that's a cabbage, not a lettuce, but. Maybe not. We've got a lady bed down here again as well and his big floppy hat. And then again, you've got your drills and your little kit. And it looks like, yep, yeah, we're a mixture. If you look on the back, uh, you can see where your DMC codes go up to. And then when you get to like far, uh, there's a number four, a 25 and a 26. They'll all be crystal gems. So uh, that's Benjamin. And then we have the Flopsy Bunnies. Again, I love the packaging. And they're a good size, these as well. You know, there's quite a bit to diamond paint. This one's got all the flower in the middle. What are they? Are they... I'm thinking hollyhocks, but I don't think they are. The Deadly Nightshade? No. I don't know. I can't remember what they are, but they look like that. <laughs> and you've got your three bunnies to paint as well. So it just makes it sparkle. Again, great for pictures. Um, this one has this one only has eight colours and we go up to 738 on DMC and then we've got 5, 25 and 26 in the gems which actually is the same as Peter Rabbit. So the gems you can see there and um, see them all packaged up. You can sort of get uh, a bit of a view. Oh no you can't. So we've got the gems there. We've got say the crystals and then the resin drills okay and then we've got the first of our peters which as i say we've got um looks like these are going to be special drill easter eggs in the background there we've got your little daffodils in the background oh let's have a look at the actual picture it's bigger what am i faffing about looking at the front cover for <laughs> so yeah we've two little yellow ducklings which are really cute um and then we've got if you ever go out and you see like mummy duck and she's got loads of ducklings and they're all like the browny greeny colour with the yellow on. And then all of a sudden there'll be one little yellow one with her and it's like, oh, 
just want to pick them up and take them home. I think Mumudu could have something to say about that though. And then, yeah, we've got your Easter eggs, which are all decorated. Peter Rabbit with his um, blue coat, his iconic blue coat on. And then your daffodil. They also do um, a full range of Craft Buddy Crystal Arts stamps now as well, where you stamp the image out and then use your magic glue uh, to put over the top which then turns it into like a poured glue canvas and then you can use your leftover drills to make your own little pictures and because you've got the actual colours of Peter Rabbit and um, of the Flopsy Bunnies you'll have drills left over you can actually when you make your stamps um, up when you colour your stamps you'll actually have those colours that you can use um, and then match up and know what colours to use so you know they do think everything through um, I haven't got any of the stamps I do prefer just buying the cards as is so what have we got in this one we've got 14 different colours in this one and we've got a 101 there which I think possibly may be a special oh no because it's just a number so we've got 1, 2, 25, 26, 45 and 101 so we have what three six crystals on this one and the uh, others are all the resin drills okay so that's your little kit as you can see they all come lovely packaged i do like these i'll have to keep that one out though because that's a definite easter one i don't want to uh, put it away and suddenly realize after easter that i've got a card to do so this is peter and mrs josephine rabbit um, and this is again like a circular one but this one has like this lovely lilac -y pink background and we've got a nice like wreath um, going around the back of the bunnies the butterfly and that they're having a lovely cuddle I mean that would be fantastic for Mother's Day you know it's mummy and baby bunny that is gorgeous absolutely lovely the illustrations are just wonderful and I don't know if you've ever seen the film of um, Beatrix Potter. I think Renée Zellweger played her. And that made me cry. But it was a good film. And it was uh, nice to see. So, yeah, this one just has um, one special drill. And it's an M. Which I think we decided those were marquees. So it'll be like the um, sort of pointed oval shape. The marquee shape. Uh, in number 56. Oh, yeah, and you can see it there, look. It's uh, the crystally colour, the uh, sparkly silver with a, a coating on it, your iridescent coating, your AB coating on it. It's very nice. Okay. And then finally, Peter Rabbit himself coming under a gate and looking very suspicious. Definitely a little boy up to something, that one. <laughs> But yeah, so um, this one actually hasn't got much diamond painting on it. Oh, there's, oh, there's, there's um, like holly leaves are. I was going to say I can't see anything down here, but we've got some diamonds up here. And then again, we've got Peter in his uh, blue coat and uh, just looking both ways to see if he's going to get caught or not. And this one has only nine colours and we've got 26 and 28 as you crystal gems so i'm presuming they will go on the leaves because they're green so a nice little haul um always worth checking out they do um do disney ones i've got all of the disney cards and um, so if you want to check out my other unboxings and everything i have um done unboxings on all the disney cards as well and they have got marvel coming out and there is Spider-Man and Superman and Iron Man and Captain America and all sorts. So if you check out the Craft Buddy Crystal Art website, you'll see all the new ones that are coming up. But as I say, when you get these, don't just think of them, of them as a greetings card. Think of them as like a, a mini picture. And they are something that are quite easy to just pick up um, and do, I don't know, what, 30 minutes possibly um an hour on some of the more intricate ones but i would think about 20 30 minutes maybe a little bit longer for doing these and you've got a lovely little project at the end my uh, seven-year-old granddaughter loves doing these she got a mermaid one um and she likes doing the notebooks as well because she does like to write everything down these days <laughs> 
like it if you've got any uh, questions or comments if you leave them in the comments down below and i'll answer them as best i can um, and if you've enjoyed seeing these with me a thumbs up is always much appreciated and if you want to come back and see more and i will be getting the marvel cards as well when they come out and possibly some of the other bits and pieces then if you click on that subscribe button and the all notifications bell next to you you'll be notified when any of my videos come up so thanks ever so much for stopping by and i do hope to see you all again soon Bye for now.